my class with me, Miss Wendy. So today we are going to learn about fraction of a set. What is fraction of a set? Let's check this explanation. Hi, primary four. Are you ready for today? All right. Welcome back to my class with Miss Wendy in math. Today we are going to learn about fraction of a set. You ready? Let's start to see this statement. What is the meaning of this statement? Andy gives two-fifths of 15 marbles to his brother. So, from the statement, we have to find the keyword to be interpreted. The first one, we have two-fifths. And the second one is 15 marbles. Now we are going to interpret the meaning of two-fifths of 15 marbles. Let's check this picture. Two-fifths. If we write it in a fraction, it will be two out of five. And if we draw the meaning of two out of five, it means this. So you have one object as a whole, then you divide that object into five parts and shade two parts of five parts. And the other keyword is talking about 15 marbles. In here, we're trying to find out the meaning of two out of five from 15 marbles. How many is it? Means. As a whole, in a circle, we have 15 marbles. So 15 marbles is supposed to be a whole marbles that we have. Okay? And then, based on the denominator that we have, which is 5, it means that this circle that consists with 15 marbles is supposed to be divided into 5 parts equally. Remember, y5 because 5 is the denominator from 2 out of 5, right? After we divide this circle, which is consists with 15 marbles into 5 parts equally, it means that each part of the circle will have 3 marbles each okay as the numerator that we have is 2 it means from 5 parts of this circle okay we only pack 2 part of it so the 2 part is equal with six marbles. So I can say that two fifths of 15 marbles is equals to six marbles. That is the meaning of a fraction of a set. Thank you so much for your attention. See you around. So that was the explanation about a fraction of a set. I hope the explanation can make you more understand.